How to change localhost to a custom domain in Champ. Hey guys, welcome to Pixel Reflect. In this video, I will show you how you can use a custom domain instead of localhost. This domain can be any domain you want, even domains that you don't own. Also, you can use any extensions you want. However, I recommend sticking to .local or .test extensions so you don't get confused with other domains. In this guide, I assume you already have Champ installed and WordPress running on localhost. If you don't, please follow my guide to install Champ and WordPress. I will leave a link in the description. If you plan to install multiple instances of WordPress, then you should use a custom domain for each instance. To do that, we will need to set up a virtual host for each website. This sound more complicated than it actually is. We just need to edit two files. First, we need to edit the vhosts file. You can quickly access this file from the Champ control panel like this. Open this file and copy-paste the code from my website at the very end of this file. Make sure to change the document root to the root folder where WordPress is installed. Change the server name to your custom domain. You can choose any domain you want but it's a good practice to use the local extension for all your local websites. Close the file after you save your changes and follow this path to find the host's file. You will need admin access to edit this file, so depending on your system, you might be asked to enter your password or reopen the file as administrator. Enter your custom domain next to localhost like this. As a side note, I advise you not to use the .dev extension. This is because Chrome will automatically force HTTPS on these domains. This change has been added to Chrome after Google bought the dev top level domain. I will leave a link in the description if you want to learn more about the subject. Make sure to save your changes then go to the database and open the options table. Change the site URL and home options to your custom domain URL. That's all the changes you need to make. Now you just need to restart the Apache module from the Champ control panel like this. Now your WordPress website runs on your custom domain. If you try to visit any page other than the homepage and you see this error, you can fix it by visiting the permalink settings page. This will generate the required rewrite rules for your URLs to work on your custom domain. If you find this video helpful, please subscribe and leave a like. I really appreciate your support. I have more beginner-friendly guides like this coming in the future. Thanks for watching.